Hey guys, welcome to a news video. I was not really expecting anything, but here we are. And first of all, let's start off with something easy. Half energy campaign. Uh, pretty easy, nothing special there. Forgive the new game in game sounds. Item world, everything boosted, nothing special really at this point, but it is item world. Get in there and do that stuff. That would be a bundle for, I guess, gets out of the bag now, but I like how they're using parts of the anniversary background. You can see the balloons and stuff about the towers, really. <laughs> a little on the lazy side, but oh well. So you can get for 10 key lapis, obviously you can see there, random of these units. Also, one five star EX ticket, one four, four star uh, ticket, guaranteed ticket, 20 summon tickets, 50 star, 50% trust removal. I don't know, guys. That's. Inky Lapis is pretty expensive. We have to see what the step up looks like because we don't know. But, uh, yeah, we don't know what the step up is. <laughs> I don't know if that's worth it, honestly. Here's the. My fancy. X2 event. I didn't even know that they would even acknowledge it, so here it is. Uh, it's basically like an exploration where you get equipment, but unfortunately I believe the equipment is uh, for, the, for them only, which kind of sucks. The Riku one, the upgraded one, would be really good because it's 200, 200 HP, 100 MP, 20 28 defense spirit and also paralyzed with fire resist and also guts. So the guts would be the main thing, but unfortunately it's only for her, but it would be nice. Oh, so you can get like 1% trust move, that's apparently what they're sell trying to sell us. It's just not really that interesting. 100% or 1% trust move is like I've got tons of those. I don't really don't need them, so. And you're seeing it now, yep. Final Fantasy X2 event. All three of them are sound fest and none of them are CG, so that's really pissing me off because guys I've been I've been waiting months. I've been waiting so many months for this event. I didn't know if we'd ever get five star Riku. And now she's here. Riku, Riku is my one of my all-time favorite characters in the entire franchise. So you guys know how this is gonna go down and I'm really not happy about it because I was gonna try and just save for a while, but now this came out, so I have, I'm not gonna. There's not gonna be like a 10 part pull video. I'm, I'm gonna have limits, guys. I'm gonna have limits this time. Um, like, I'm gonna try my best to go for at least four Riku, but the other two I can just go for two, I think. But we'll see what happens. See what happens. Uh, so let's just like go over the units very quickly, I guess. Um, the Chimars are just, it's just not very good, I don't think. 30% attack, and also should percent light and dark resist, which is nice on its own, actually. But the TMR just seems kind of weak. 40% attack on its own, uh, someone fest TMR, not, not, not the best. But the Agun is 170 attack. 50% attack and also MP, re MP refresh, so that's a little better. The 50% attack will help uh, getting to the attack hat pretty easily, so not too bad of a gun. There's a lot of guns in the game already, like uh, the Icebird one could be a potential replacement. Here's what I've been waiting for. BQ. Her, her accessory is 30, 30 defense, 30 spirit. Poison, sleep, sleep, uh, poison, sleep, can silence, use, resist, and also 30% under resist, which is, it's pretty bad, it's pretty bad. Uh, the TMR is pretty bad, but the STMR is not the worst. 30% attack, or the dagger, 30% HP and attack, and also 6 long first crystals per turn, that's half the amount that you're allowed to even get, that's, that's pretty high. And she's supposed to be like a really good breaker, but I'm not really going to listen to any of their marketing, because we know how... They did with things like Beowulf, like you're supposed to be like the best breaker of all time or something, and then he was garbage, so 
But apparently she's supposed to be able to get like 80% breaks, so it's probably gonna be like the next stage breaker, I think. But I feel like Elfin will still be relatively good because she can also do buffs, so we'll, we'll have to see what Riku can do. And then finally Pain. <laughs> and then I just don't think any other team members are groundbreaking for- these are Soundfest units guys, they're supposed to be good, but her team art is an accessory. 15 defense and 15 spirit. Resist, blind, paralyzed, confused, and virus. 30% attack and auto region buff. That's just really bad. I don't I don't I don't know what they were I don't know what they were smoking when they made these TMRs, but they're just not very good. Grass TMR is actually quite good, but I mean, it's an S TMR. <laughs> 976 attack, I assume it's two-handed, because she's supposed to be a TD unit, I believe, so there'd be no reason to go for it if it's not two-handed. And also, 40% fire, ice, water, and thunder, so that's really high. So, she gives herself main year and booster mods and stuff, so mostly most of the damage here, but I, the only thing I really don't like is that their AT chaining frames are going to be, uh, for Pain and Yuna, they're going to be AT chaining. That's just not so good anymore, guys. I don't know, guys. And they're going to have rotating banners, of course, so... I don't know. I really want them. I want Pain 6 2 is one of my all-time favorites, even though it's not particularly anybody else's favorite, really, but it's my personal favorite. If you hate the game, then I guess you don't have to worry about pulling, but I really, I really want 5 star Riku, so... Uh, the sprite looks amazing. I just wish it was CG, but... I mean, that's a pipe dream, pretty much. Anyways, that's really it, guys. I know what you guys think about the news. Uh, you're gonna ignore this banner, like probably most people are. Or you're gonna try and go into it, go into it like me. We'll have to see what the step up looks like. We didn't know anything about the step up yet. I'm just hoping it's not absolute garbage, so it'll actually help me get the units. Uh, making them rotating is simple. It makes them kind of kind of simple. Like, uh, I don't know. Like, uh, I don't know. Maybe it'll be easy to get them. I don't know. We'll have to see. But. Summon Fest pool is getting bigger and they're not reducing the other rainbows in the Summon Fest pool, so we'll, it's a little on the tough side. We'll have to see what happens. Anyways, guys, I know you guys think about the news. Let me know what you guys think about other things, whatever you want to say. It doesn't matter to me. As long as you just leave a comment, leave a subscription, and also please leave a like on the video if you liked it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.